Hello everybody and welcome back to Assassin's Creed Odyssey. So this is why I have three bounty hunters after me is because I'm in this particular area. And that's why I can't pay them off either. And it's because I had to I had to look at the quest to like clarify it, but Lagos uh, has have, has every mercenary under Helios under the sun on the hunt for Cassandra and her mother. So, that's why I can't pay them off, and that's why there's three of them. Um, fun. Fun, fun. And I'm actually getting really, really close to wanting to buy that stupid level up perk. Or the, um, You know, the thing that, like, I guess the boost that, like, gives you more drachma and experience. So that you can, uh, level up faster. Because this is ridiculous. Like, I mean, I don't know. I didn't think I was taking too long to level up before. I felt like it was pretty fair, pretty pretty decent. But at this rate, like, to in order to progress the story, it's gonna... Like, I have to be up to, like, level 45 or something to progress the story. So, yeah. And that's gonna take freaking, like, it's taking me this long. It's taking me, this is what, episode 89? It's taking me this long to get here. Like, I don't know. I feel like at this point I'm like, you win, Ubisoft. I'll spend extra money on your game. This is how it's going to be for single player games now, if you have to pay to actually play the game and level up in a decent amount of time. Like, I don't mind games that, like, I don't know, you kind of have to grind, I guess? But, like, this is like, I don't know, this is not a grindy type game. And the side quests aren't quite as invigorating as Origins were. So, I'm like, eh. Animals outnumber people three to one in the air. Better watch out for predators. Okay. Like farm animals or animal animals? I did notice a lot of like bears. Uh, is that a wolf? No, okay. Is it a boar? There's a boar. I don't know if it's a pig or a boar. Oh, please. This is hideout? It's not very hideouty. The safe house? There has to be some proof around here. What do you mean? Have I chosen wrong? <laughs> Probably. You came. Lagos still lives then. What exactly is this place? Lagos is a very public figure in Acadia. This is where he handles his more private affairs. Remind me, why are you covering for the man who wants me and my mother dead? I've known Lagos a long time. He got supplies through to my lines when my soldiers were ah. starving. For him to act so dishonorably is completely out of character. What are you looking for? If we can find out who's manipulating Lagos, there'll be no need for blood. I thought Spartans drank yeah. blood for breakfast. <laughs> I've seen enough for two lifetimes. Still, I have hope. <laughs> You're getting so ah. When Leonidas died at the hot gates, we all came together against a common enemy. Athenians, Spartans, fighting side by side. What is it? <laughs> Someone's here. They would definitely have heard us. Were you followed? No. Good. You have the letter from Lagos? I do. Our job is to deliver this to the scorched tree. Near a golden field. Someone will meet us there and take it to the hideout. Dun dun dun! A letter from Lagos? It could have the answers we need. I'll follow them. You keep searching the house. You're getting soft. Okay. Drop off point in Arcadia. Uh, 
Jeez, we got a quest right next to you. Baking bread, I love baking bread. I need to bake some bread actually this weekend. My artisanal bread. The drop off points in Arcadia is north of the Archon safe house. It's at the scorched tree. It, no, oh! At, near the golden fields. I was like, oh, it's uh, near some golden fields. But no, this whole region is just called golden fields. Cool. And there's an animal over there. So like in these, the, the, the like, the like uh, golden question marks, they had like a very personal meaning to, uh, oh shoot, what's his name? The character in Origins. Like each one was like, you know, about his son, essentially. And now these ones, I'm pretty sure for the most part, are just animals I have to kill. <sighs> I don't know. I've liked both a lot. I love the fact, like, I'll, I will, I wouldn't trade, I wouldn't trade anything for the, the fact that I can play as Cassandra, for the, for one thing. And I, I really do, like, I don't know, I like the armor systems. Each game, I like, I, I don't know, I have, I have, I like, I like things about them all. I don't mind if they change that up, but please, for the love, for the love of Helios, let me just play the game without having to buy XP. This isn't a multiplayer game. I knew it. I just guessed because I was like, straight north near the golden fields. I'm like, probably this question mark then. Sneaky, sneaky. Hmm. Does it have, like, cards? Let's... Oh, well, okay. Find and reach the drop-off point. Okay, so hopefully I will... Oh. Okay. It said, kill the guard, but I don't see a guard. Is that like, were they like, torturing this person? Or that's, that's already somebody dead. Oh, that's a big bummer. Okay, hello. Shh, follow me. I think. I don't know. <laughs> I'm guessing. I was brought here with Lagos' ah! family. I thought we'd be killed. Where are they? Below ground. With many guards. I need you to go tell my friend Brasidas I found them. He should be in an old farmhouse northeast of Tierra. I'll do it. Thank the gods you came to help us. I'm glad I got here in time. Jeez. Be safe now. Oh, over there. Okay. I'll get closer, and then whoop, I will search for the guards. Hopefully, that slack jawed messenger will be here soon. What's so important about the letters that they give us? Malaka! Anyone could follow the messenger straight to the family. <laughs> well, apparently, that hideout was being guarded, and we didn't notice. Either that, or Brasidas already took care of them. I think if Brasidas had already took care of them, though, I would have noticed. Like, or he would have said something like, Yeah, I had to murderize a bunch of people. Um, okay. Fields of grain! No. Oh, okay. There we go. Alright, I'm gonna have to get closer. And it's night time, so I'm extra stealthy and extra murdery. Alright, come on. Show me guards of some sort. No? Really just you guys. I mean, I, depending on where the entrance is, I can just sneak right in. Okay. Oh, oh, that was really easy, actually. Wow. So easy, in fact, that I am concerned. I don't, like,
like usually it shows me if there are guards underground in the vicinity, but it's not doing that right now. Well, here we go. Come on, drop. Oh, oh. Wonder what's down here. Wonder what's down here. Blah, blah, blah. Whoa. Gluten free? What? Explore the cave? <laughs> what? <laughs> Gluten free? <laughs> After discovering that Cole had kidnapped Lagos' family, Cassandra found the entrance to the cave where they were being held hostage. I kind of want to go back for Brasidas, but at the same time. Okay, so it's just his family that's being kept down here, not, not Lagos himself. So they're being kept, so his family's being kept hostage, essentially. So if I free his family, he should be a little more free to do things. Okay. But, I kind of want Brastidas here, but I bet you if I went back, it would just be him searching around and I wouldn't be able to do anything. Okay. I didn't expect an underwater cave. I was like, I don't think they would have freaking brought an entire family down through an underwater cave. I am mighty suspicious. She called my lanta. We couldn't be louder if we wanted to. I think that's just a little cove. Yeah. A little resource. Oh, no. Okay. Ain't over here? Maybe I shouldn't have pulled out. A torch, but... Okay, hang on. Where are they? Whoa! Whoa, whoa, I didn't mean to go under. Why are there two of them? Oh, please, feel free to keep going. I might actually be able to sneak past them. Oh, lovers. Okay, they're distracted. Even cultists can have lovers. think there's an ability you can get where you can do that and it will like as you level up this the search ability I think it marks guards for you through walls and stuff take a chill pill and sit there for a bit and I'll attempt to uh, stealth assassinate this one over here 
Oh my, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, please don't come into the bushes. I could potentially kill at least one of the not captain people. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. Oh my gosh, they're all like sleeping. Could I? Oh, oh cool, thanks. Shh. I wonder. Okay, hang on. I wonder if I could kill the one who's sitting instantly if it wouldn't wake up everybody else. We'll try. Because I could use my one ability there on the. Hang on. On the left. But it doesn't tell me how much damage I do when I do that. Oh my freaking gosh, guys. Okay. Success. Oh crap. Crap, it's not letting me do it. Okay. Oh my gosh, I need to get like super close. That was terrifying. Okay. Jumpy. I'm trying to break that. Okay. I don't know. If she, I don't think she'll go after that, but I just killed her lover. She's really sad. I'm, I am kind of sad also. thing and it's like whoa could you not oh no oh no oh i tried to do i tried to uh, i tried to do the thing i tried to parry that that was not what i should have been doing i'm sorry you guys are cultists like i had to kill her light this on fire again. <laughs> what? No! I tried to dodge and it wouldn't let me. No! Okay, though. I say it before this and I got it to work at least a little bit. But do you guys notice, like, it, it it doesn't, it won't let me do the hold unless I'm so close I actually trigger them to wake up. Like, I, I can't, like, I, all it would do is, like, get half their health if I just do the, if I do the quick strike. I have to hold it, and it won't let me hold unless I'm so close they wake up. Like, oh, it's so frustrating. It's okay, though. We did pretty good. We did pretty good. We killed three of the four, and I just, I wanted to get the, the little ones not, and not the captain out of the way. What? Wait. Why did it save me? It's, What? Why did it save right there with with things breaking? Oh no! Oh no no! 
Oh, no, 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 no. No. Okay, was that an autosave? Where's the manual save I did? This one? Okay. It put me on the newest one, which was an autosave. Which... Autosave right after I manual saved for when things were... When I wasn't in cover, for one thing. Which I was when I manually saved. And... But things were exploding randomly for another, like I had been running around doing damage. I, that was weird. That was weird. Like, nobody was dead. Like, I, 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 technically I should have maybe, it should, at least one of them should have been dead. But they weren't. And like, I don't know, it was like, it was like, here's the instance we're gonna throw you into. We're gonna randomize it. Okay. Yes, everyone go to sleep. Night nights. Oh my gosh, are they not gonna go to sleep this time? Because she was sleeping next to her. Oh my gosh, and there's a freaking bandit! There's a mercenary coming! Oh my gosh, okay, well, my excellent plan. I'm gonna... I'm gonna have a cow. I'm so angry right now. Things were going so well, and now it's like purposely screwing me over. They're trying to let all three of these bandit, all three of these mercs walk in. There's no way I can take this guy out without a fight. Oh my gosh. This is frustrating. Uh, maybe I'll try this one. Like, if I knew how to use the bounty hunters as a distraction for my benefit, things would be better, but I don't. Like, I don't... I don't know of a way to do that. Oh my gosh, are you... They're inside?! How are they already inside?! They weren't inside last... How are the saves changing?! I don't understand! How are the saves changing?! The bounty hunter was not here last time I saved in here. I don't understand. And they know exactly where I am and then they hang out in the area. It's so frustrating. Is that one actually in there? I think there's one actually in there already. You can't just alter my save files like this! Like, I purposely go back to a save to, to re-instigate the scenario that was playing and replay that scenario. But no, you're gonna modify? I didn't even know you could modify saves like that. It's not even a save anymore. It's like a randomly generated, you know, screw you button. They're even changing who's sitting down. Like, this time it's a woman. It's not that guy over there. See, it's not letting me... See? It wouldn't let me hold, it only let me do the one where it's like, here, I'm gonna poke you. Oh my gosh, I'm so angry right now. It would let me do the other one from the bushes, but maybe it's the fact that I'm not in the bushes that I can't do, that I had to like stand on them before I can do the full stealth assassinate. I want you guys to realize how ridiculous this situation is. They keep walking past me, which is nice. I guess. But, like, that woman was kind of stuck here because she couldn't move. Because I was in the way, in the bush. 
and now they're all good. Like they wandered up here, put their their weapons away, which was different, and now this ba these bounty hunters are just gonna chill out in here. And everybody's gonna be asleep, and it's a freaking perfect situation. But there's six bounty hunters following me, and oh my gosh, this is so frustrating! I don't know why they're in here when they weren't before. And they're just gonna chill out in my vicinity. Like, I don't know if I have to, like, leave and then come back to, like, get them to go away. Like, honestly, I was trying to give this game the benefit of the doubt, but the more I've talked about it with people and the more I've played, the more I've realized this is not an Assassin's game. This is not an Assassin's game. It's got the skin of an Assassin's game. You are not an Assassin. You're a mercenary. You're a brawler. Like, don't call it Assassin's Creed. Call it Mercenary's Creed. Like, it's fine. But don't bill it for something it's not. I literally can't- <laughs> There's seven enemies in here. Four of which I could stealth kill, maybe. Three of which I cannot. stealth assassinated that guard thankfully I had to fast travel away to get the bounty hunters away and then just killed that guard um, who was left all on her lonesome I can only see this one. Okay, the other two are sleeping. Oh, we don't have time. Pick where you're gonna go. I can't really stealth assassinate that one because it keeps spinning. Maybe it's the same one that got stuck doing that earlier. Got the second one. Oh, good. The others should be asleep. Hopefully, still. Oh, my gosh. Come on, please let me. What the? It tried to make me carry the body again! I'm so angry! Oh, I can't even... It would have been fine. Oh, I'm so upset. You're doing great, but it tries to make... So I'm so oh. Come on, children. Thank you. My life was forfeit. Oh, you're the mom. <laughs> Who are you? Cassandra. Brasida sent me. Are we going home? I have no idea. 
We've been trapped in this filthy cave for days, with no word from Lagos whatsoever. You're free, but it's not safe to return to Lagos yet. Are those scary men still with butter? I don't know. Have you heard of the cult of Cosmos? Only in whispers. Ever since my husband found new business partners, they've stationed guards around our home. For our safety, he said. Then one day, those guards dragged hmm, us here. So he might be with the cult still. Like, it might actually not be safe to have them go home if they're not being held hostage and he was just getting them out of the way. They're making your pater do things he doesn't want to do. I'll find Lagos and release him from these scary men. And what of us? I can't go back to that reps. And now that these guards are dead, we're in danger. The wretch, are you mad at Lagos? Go to my friend Brasidas. He'll meet you at the safe house, northeast of Teyea. Where Lagos has his secret meetings. Are you angry, Matter? I am grateful you saved us. We'll go find Brasidas. Here. Hmm, I feel like she knows more. Why is it called gluten-free? Brain, brain-free? Like... Like, grain-free, like, you know how Lagos does grain stuff, I guess? I don't know. Family-free? I don't know. What's the rest of this? Are there more guards in here? Dog! Oh my gosh. If I don't take him on a walk first thing every morning, he gets pissed. Oh, hey. A secret. Okay, so now I only have two bounty hunters after me. Possibly because... Oh, another entrance. Possibly because I did something to lessen Lagos' influ influence, or the cult's influence, or something. But if I do one thing wrong, they'll be on to me. I feel like there might be guards at this entrance? No? Okay, just another entrance. Cool. Alright. Interesting. So at one point, I tried to go back, I don't know if I'm going to show any of it, but I tried to go back and fight the mercenaries, the bounty hunters, because I wasn't sure. I'm like, if I kill one, will they, will he just send another one after me? Like, is it worth it to kill one? And I got her, like, halfway down, and then she, like, threw three bombs in a row at me and killed me, like, decimated me. She's only level 32, like, I... <laughs> So, this game, like, it punishes you for fighting by making the other enemies take so little damage and making you take so much damage. But, so you're like, okay, I have to stealth assassinate everything. I have to be super stealthy. But then the game also punishes you because it doesn't, like, give you the resources or the, like, it doesn't give you enough firepower to actually assassinate and it doesn't give you enough, like... The stealth isn't great, like, there's not a lot of places to hide, the guards don't operate in such a way that makes it easy to stealth kill them, like, you know, because they, op they operate in pairs. And I wish I had a distraction mechanism that wasn't just, like, something that alerted everybody in the vicinity. Yeah, I can have my bird harassed, yeah, I can have a lieutenant come in, but that's gonna alert everybody. What I want is, like, a rock I can throw to, like, send them in a different direction, at least one of them, so I can, uh, like, sneak by or stealth kill somebody, you know? But what I have instead are abilities that, instead of, you know, distracting and making it easier for me, it makes it more difficult by alerting everybody in the area that I'm there. <laughs> anyway, this has been really frustrating. I'm really frustrated. And <laughs> I'm gonna go now. I'm gonna go, take a walk, do something else, and try to not break my controller in half. <laughs> So thank you all for joining me. I do appreciate it. And I hope to see you in the next one.